Hey, what's up, YouTube? Today I'm going to show you how to add Nest ROMs to your iPhone and iPod Touch 2.0 and above. Okay, right, first thing you have to do is have a jailbroken iPhone or iPod Touch. Go to your iPhone. I have an iPhone. So I would open up City right here. Just open it up. Make sure you're connected to the internet. That way um, you can get it. Okay, go down here where it says Home. It'll automatically load. The easiest way to download these is by going to Featured Packages. Let's click on that. Another page will load. There's three things you have to download. And if you don't know how to download them, I'll show you right now. The first thing you have to do is boss is download boss prefs. Just click on it to download it. Go to the top right corner. Click on it. Little top right corner. Little top right corner. Sorry, I have a camera in my hand, so it's kind of hard. Okay, click install. I already have it installed, so it says reinstall. Um, go back. The next thing you have to do is scroll down and download Ness. And also, you have to download. Open SSH. I'll put it in the description in case you forget. After you have those downloaded, click your home button and make sure they're downloaded. In order for what we're gonna do to work, go open up your boss press, click on it, um, and go to where it says SSH. Make sure it's on. If it's not on, then what we're gonna do isn't gonna work. Another thing, make sure you go to settings, go to, first to do, go to general, go to auto lock right there, and if it's on something else, make sure you turn it to never. If it's not on never, it's not going to work. The next thing is go to Wi-Fi, make sure you're connected to some sort of thing. Mine's right there, so you click on the little blue arrow. And your IP address is right there. Just leave that open for now because you're going to need it. Now what you have to do is make sure that you go, make sure that you download WinSCP. It's right there. I'll put a link in the description over there on how to download it. So um, just open that up. Just open that up and uh, here it is. If you don't have one of the little things already, just click new go to your host name it's going to be your ip address that you have on your iphone or ipod touch mine's 192.168 that's how pretty much all of them are going to start so just keep that in mind it's, it does and then whatever okay now after you typing your ip address go to username right there and you're going to type in root r o o t then go to your password, type in Alpine, A-L-P-I-N-E. If you forget all this stuff, I'll put it in the description. All right, click on save right there where it says it. Click save. Make sure you click OK so it saves it. This thing will come up. You can save it as whatever you want. All right, I'll click OK to save it. Now it's right here in my list. Um, just click on it and go down here where it says log in. It will start to log in. If your thing says like, oh, it doesn't work or something, that means that something is turned off. Make sure that everything is turned on. Okay. So that's what it should look like when it's open. Now you need to go to um, Mozilla Firefox or whatever internet browser you have. You could close out of um, your setting on your phone. Okay. Open up your internet browser. Go to, type in on Google, the old computer. Computer, oh, sorry, I spelled it wrong. Dot com. Click enter. Um, I'll start to look for it. Oh, wait, oh, I spelled it wrong, so I have a video camera in my hand, so it's kind of hard to type. Um, click on it. My computer is really slow, so I'm sorry. That it's going really slow. Um, 
what you're gonna do is make sure that loads and the first thing should be the old computer dot com um just double click on that so it opens this is their page just go down here where it says rom downloads double click on that and another page will come and download uh here it is it's loading 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 okay this is for nest you can also use it for GBA ROMs, but in this video I'm going to show you how to use it for NES. It works the same way for GBA though, if you also want to do it for GBA. Um, okay, the page just finished loading almost. Okay, uh, you ha since we're downloading it for Nintendo, uh, NES, uh, Nintendo, you're going to scroll down after the page loads. Okay. Go down until you find Nintendo. Right here it says Nintendo in white letters. Um, go down. Right here it says enter Entertainment System. Click on NES. Uh, a whole page of ROMs will download now. But first you have to select which category you want it in. There's numbers through L. And then there's M through Z. You could choose whatever you want. I'm not really looking for any specific right now. I'm just looking to get one. Um, so let's wait for this to load. Okay, it's almost done loading. Ah, oh, it's still loading. The way you know if it's done downloading is by going to your right left corner, I mean. It's, it'll say done if it's done, but <laughs> mine isn't done yet, so. Okay, here it is. Here's the uh, thing I was telling you about. Uh, I'm not looking for anything, so just I'll just click on this one, I guess. Um, this page will load, and it's full of ROMs, numbers through L. So just click on whichever one you want. All you have to do is double-click on it, and it'll start to download Kind of running out of time. Okay, I'll just click on the first one. It says 10 yard fight. No, I don't want that. Uh, actually, I want hmm, Ad Adventures of Tom Story or whatever. No, wait. <laughs> Sorry, I can't pick a good. Uh, no, Afro Mario Bros. That sounds kind of cool. All you have to do is double click on it the way I did. And a little box will appear right here in this area at some point. Here it is. All you have to do is click OK because it'll save it to your home screen page. OK, you download page. It says it's done. So let's minimize our thing. And there it is. Afro Bros. Afro Mario Bros. Uh, double click on it so you can open the folder and here it is right there if it's like that if it looks just like that you have to right click it click uh no or you could just double click it and this thing will it'll pop up it says dot right here it says dot nes make sure it says that and i won't work just drag that over here onto your home screen or uh, you could close the folder and open it up your WinSCP, I have it right here. To download them to them, just go right here, click the arrow, go down to where it says uh, mobile, can't see it. Oh, mobile right here. Now oh, where is it? Can't see. Mobile right there. Okay, and go to media. And there should be a folder right there that says ROMs. If not, just right click. Click new and then click folder. Okay, I have next. Click double click on that folder. Ah, uh, sorry, I clicked on the wrong one. Just click this one to go back. Nest. Okay, here are all my nest ROMs. To download it, all you have to do is drag this file onto it. Uh, just click copy. It'll go and it's right there. Okay, that was my quick video on uh, how to 
download ROMs. I'm running out of time, so I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Bye. Please comment, rate, and subscribe.